We just hit 3 million power. Another day of not logging in all day long for me today, guys. So what we're going to do is kind of jump into the game. I'm kind of in the mood to maybe do some barbarian farming. Get some things going. We got to collect our troops and obviously collect our loot. Look at that. Completely builds up right there, guys. It's it's time. We need to actually make this all work out right here. So we're going to start training up some troops again. There we go. And we kind of got to get them going all the way around. Also, I need to remind you this is sponsored content because I am partnered with Rise of Civilizations. And if you want more daily Rise of Civilizations content. Sub the channel. Turn notifications. We are going to see what kind of free chests we can grab right here if we can get anything good out of here. Oh, a Dragon Lancer. Let's go. We'll take the Dragon Lancer. I have a hospital right now that can be built. We're going to get that going and ask for help as we're sitting here. And that's going to go nicely. And some research that can be done. Oh, guys, what do you think? I haven't been logging in purposely so I could do this stuff with you guys here in the videos just for fun. There we go. We got that going as well. Looks like we have a good amount of loot right here and rewards to collect all of around before I go in and do any of those uh, barbarian attacks. So what's going on over here? Is this event over? It looks like the cornucopia event might be over right now. Yeah, that ended and we did have a video out on that the other day, but let's still collect all these rewards. There's rewards across the board, all over the place. We want them here. We want them there. We want rewards everywhere. Esmeralda's house. Great fortune, best rewards available. Okay. I don't really know. Uh, I don't know what that is yet. Maybe we'll do a video on that too at some other time. It's possible. Not sure what's going on. What's over here in the shop? It looks like we have. I'll take that right there. And uh, we'll go with this right here. I'll take that. Sure. These deals, how do you pass them up? They're amazingly amazing. Does that make sense? And we'll grab that. And we'll say goodbye to the shop day. But we got to see what kind of rewards we have over here. And it looks like there's a lot of rewards for our daily objectives, which I am just touching for the first time right here today. And in here, we have uh, just some regular basic stuff. And we have another chest ready to roll. We have to grind some stuff, guys. We have to start getting some things going. So we're going to start that out by um, by going after some barbarians. I think we have some, one more thing we could build. This is a level 16. That's a level 18. Can I upgrade this here? I can. Let's get more. We're going to go ahead and go with the most amount of wood I can use. We're going to get all those. And here we're going to go with the most amount of stone I could use. Is that going to be enough? Ooh, here we go. We'll go with that right there. Boom, 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 boom. There we go. We're going to upgrade that. It's going to take 23 hours. And then we'll have a max gold mine, which is always sweet. And we'll claim this reward right here. Now, we got more rewards. Sorry. Wait, we just got to get more rewards. The daily offer. We'll just take the loot as it comes. There we go. Thank you. Now, barbarian farming. We did this in the Cornucopia event that I had a video out on the other day, and we talked about some effective ways to farm. Today, we're going to just kind of see what's around us. Ooh, we got some good stone spots to farm right there as well. Three areas of stone. What I'm going to do is go attack these level 21 barbarians right here with my troops. I'm just, why would they choose her? Why would they go in with her? I'm going to go with him and with him. That's going to be our march right there. We're going to go in again and attack more with Boudica. Then we're going to go in and attack again with, yeah, I like that right there. And then we're even going to gonna go in with one more batch and we're going to attack with we got this man lohar right here it's a suicide mission for him but he should be okay being that he's got all the other troops in front of him that's kind of like what we do you know we get the tanks in front like we said in another video just like clash of clans let's see how this battle goes as these guys go into battle with level 21 barbarians it should be okay it should be profitable it should be sweet let's see coffee house the battle's taking place right here. We have Minamoto doing well, Boudicca's doing well, and Joan of Arc is holding her own right here. The they are all above health of that Barbarian. Lohar, though, that's my concern. He didn't have the troop support, and his level is a little bit low, so we're gonna see how well he holds up. Make sure he doesn't get too low. If he does, I'll just retreat him, get him back in the battle before the battle is over. But it looks like the Barbarians are gonna be going down, and that's gonna be pretty darn sweet. What I'm gonna actually do, I don't even need to watch anymore. We're gonna go and search up some level 13 Barbarian. And we're going to attack them next on the way back because, well, everyone can go in and get a double dip in here. So we're going to attack here and we'll march there. We're going to attack here and we'll march with her. And we're going to attack here and we'll march with uh, Boudica. And we'll attack here and we'll march with Minamoto. Let's see how this all goes down. Let's hope the right guys get there at the right time and the battle goes the right way. We're in the woods, in the bushes, in the uh, the greenery, green ridge, greenage forestry and this should be a really easy battle i mean level 13 my minamoto's low my lohar's low joan of arc is looking good and my boudica 
is, uh, she's fine too. So this should go down easy. There we go. It's a smash. But the cool thing about this, guys, are the rewards that I picked up. But first, always remember to heal up your troops like we're doing right here. Now check out these rewards. Like, bam, right there. We got some things of gems. So we should have eight different victory rewards in here because we did go in with eight different sets of troops. Well, two attacks with four each equals eight. Simple math. And as we scroll through and just look at the glory that we can bathe in right now, you know, I, I feel good about it. Gathering report. This is what I did right before I went to work today. A lot of stone. We had some wood going as well. And a lot of things happened in our alliance today. Pretty nice that I am in one of the top alliances here in the kingdom. And a lot of rewards right here. The, uh... Okay, so that's it right there. And uh, grateful for you. Anything in here? Yeah, we got more. We got more right there. We got more right here. Day two. We're good now. We're going to collect these rewards. That's for the level the one barbarian to attack and then five barbarians to attack. Gives us our silver key halfway through or maybe two thirds of the way through our daily objective. But I want to talk to you guys about something else today after we go over here. We're going to use these 68 chests and we're going to use those seven things of gems and these 32 chests as well. Get the corn cob and continue on going to the alliance. We're going to help. I'm going to collect these rewards here that are here every single day. My territory rewards. Always nice to claim that. And uh, we're going to come over here and we're to claim each of these rewards because you know your boy echo here likes to claim reward all the time every day we'll claim all on that good to go we're gonna join this we're gonna join this right here go after the barbarian fort and we're gonna go in with uh minamoto and uh Cao Cao. there we go piece of cake sending them in Look at the look, look at this kingdom. This is nice looking right there. Really nice job on this kingdom. Who is that? Tiberian. I think he's our number one in our alliance. He's a level, what is this? Level, can't even tell. It's showing the front level 25. Maxed out right here with the Fall Kingdom. Doesn't that look hot? You gotta love the look of the Fall Kingdom. I surely do. Tiberium with that hot look. City Hall. But we're going back to my village, which is not quite as hot. It doesn't look bad though. I mean, it's not too bad, right guys? I think my, uh, my city looks pretty sweet. Opening up my other chest. There we go. Any other... Nope, nothing great. That's cool though. But like I said, I wanted to show you guys something that was a little bit different and it's under expeditions now. Check it out, more expedition rewards, which we are gonna claim right here, confirm. But there is also a shopping cart, guys. And we have these, another area where you could purchase things. This is the secret area to purchase commander upgrades, sculptures, and things like that. So I don't know if you knew about this. Oh, we could, we could, we could spin it too. Who do we have here? A Herman sculpture, Lancelot sculpture. Okay, Dazzling. Now, what is this up here? Mm, Constance. I don't know. Which is worth buying, guys? Which one of these would you purchase if you were here? I mean, I have 27.2 thousand of these, so I can get 27 Hermans if I'd want to, if I'd want to go crazy on the upgrades of them, but I'm not sure that's what I want to do. I mean, it's Herman. Commander of the week. Cool. I wonder who it's going to be next week. We'll have to come back and check that out, but let's go back to the village. Now that we have all of our guys, they're all back. They did their, they did their attacks against the barbarians. We got our, we met our quota. We need to still finish a few things. Gold gathering. No, that's not what I want. I want it over here. Gathering, rock gathering, gold digger. I have a lot of time. Food growth, wood growth, stone growth, and power of knowledge. So you know how I like to do this. We come over here and we just knowledge up. We use five every day because it's a smart way to get that. Save it and get it. But we are going to search. We're going to farm and we're going to go right here close to home. We're going to attack. Actually, we're going to farm this stone deposit here. We got two of them right there. March and I could also probably go for some corn, which is right here. We'll grab some of that nice and close to home. And there was one more down here, I believe. It's another thing of stone. So we're gonna stone up today, guys. Oh, wait a second. Yeah, I actually uh, sent Gaius in a different direction because, well, I had Minamoto out on that quest to go defeat some barbarians. We do have to help out with our food gathering research here for the Alliance because as a top Alliance mate, you have to go in and be, uh, you know, you gotta be on top of your stuff, guys. You gotta be able to show love to the Alliance. Oh, I didn't even check if there were any ruins over here. And there are ruins. Training speed, gold gathering speed, nothing so far I'd want. Marching speed, building speed, and research speed. Well, that's a nice one. Commander XP gain. We don't need that right now. Okay. Uh, what's this last one right here? Gold gathering. No. All I'm looking for right now from the Lost Temple ruins are grabbing something that'll produce our loot or our, our goods more quickly. And we don't have that pretty soon. The Lost Temple will be ours. Pretty sure that we're going to be taking this kingdom in the next couple of weeks, guys. So that's going to be an exciting video within itself. But, um, oh, our troops are ready to go. There we go. And uh, and that's it. I want you guys to tell me right now in the comments below, what did you do in your day-to-day? -day? What went on for you guys? For me, um, it's the day before my Thanksgiving break. I know this video will probably come out a few days later because of editing and things of that nature. But it's the day before my Thanksgiving break. We had, as a teacher, I'm in the school. And we had some great feasts with the students and stuff. And it was really nice, kind of like, 
a family oriented thing, which I always love. If you love Thanksgiving, guys, if you celebrate it at all, or if you even know what Thanksgiving is, if you're from another country, throw a like here on the video. Show some love and support to your boy Echo on his Rise of Civilizations journey. Oh, we got more here. We, go. we healed them up. But I think we're going to end things out here today, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. A casual one again. Let me know what you want to see in the comments below. I have some big plans with other partner YouTubers very soon about putting some skill guide stuff together for you. And check this out. We hit 3 million power right there, guys. We are sitting at 3.037 million power. And I just realized it now at the very end of the video. On that note, guys, we are getting out of here for today. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure you show a little bit of love in the comments and with that thumbs up. Also, remember, you can always find me over on Discord. The link is also in the description below and Twitter. I love Twitter. I hope you guys like it as well. Head on over there. Follow me at Echo Through Me so you can hear about all my random tweets and uh, my game-related ones as well. That's been it, though, guys. I'll see all of you back here again tomorrow. Until then, be good.